progress of law like it's been written. It hasn't, uh, and the, uh, the carve out, as Ed calls it, uh, for the early settlement has, uh, I think, a fair number of consumer protections in it, including a um, payback provision. If the plant doesn't get built, the ratepayers get their money back. It has a cap built into it. So it just shows you that construction work in progress can be whatever the state legislature and the Public Service Commission decides it should be. In Georgia, for example, uh, where they have construction work in progress and they are charging the rate payers for that, they have until the plan is built to do prudence reviews to ensure that the utility spent all that money prudently. So they took for the entire thing of the project. Um, prudence reviews, I'm glad you brought that up. Um, you could get to 99% completion on a nuclear reactor, and they could find a fault line, no fault, pun intended, to the people building it, for example. Uh, they could get to 99% done. The, the Public Service Commission, through a prudence review, could determine that that money was prudently spent if uh, there was no fault of the builders, and the utility payers will still be paying for a reactor it is not producing electricity. Not a credible event uh, in that it was an example. The, the depth at which we do reviews, our early site permit documentation, uh, approximately 8,000 pages to study the geography to extreme detail. And uh, while you know, it's, the, the likelihood of that happening is, is very remote, and if it did happen, it would be up to the Public Service Commission to determine who was proved and who wasn't. You, you might recall this, I can't remember the name of the project, I believe it was in California where um, the, 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 the builders of two reactors instead of, uh, I believe it was something with the, the seismology uh, tests for the reactor uh, were determined to be uh, put in, uh, placed in the wrong position and the reactor never became operable because of that. Diablo Canyon. Diablo Canyon has been running for, for many years and continues to run today. It's a very successful plant in California. The one on the fault line, or near the fault line? I believe there is a fault uh, off the shore, and that plant is designed for that uh, type of environment. The, the reactors that we saw in San and in North Anna, uh, they, they meant the they met or were barely constructed to handle the, the 5.8 and during during that episode, which has actually caused the NRC to go back and make uh, completely recalculate, and they're still working on this in the wake of that earthquake uh, provisions for safety rules for the entire eastern United States for reactors, which is where most of the reactors are. Sorry. <laughs>